Hi there, my name is Bryson Jack and I just wanted to show a quick tip on how to make a selection from a beginning point to an ending point. Sometimes you want to make a, an edge selection or a selection and um, the edge loop is is doing too much. Like uh, if I hold down Alt and I, and I select this, you can see that it goes all the way around. But if I just want to select this particular edge, then I can select the beginning point and I can select the ending point. And if it is really the shortest path that I want to select, I can go to the Select menu and I can choose Shortest Path and it will make that selection for me. But this doesn't always work because, or it's not the best solution in, in, in all cases because if I wanted to select this entire edge around the bottom of this key and end over here, and then I select Shortest Path, obviously what I was doing was not the shortest path this is. And so that's not what I want. So the solution in that particular circumstance is to uh, select the beginning point and then hold down control and you can just go ahead and you can add to your selection all the way around. There you go. And that also does work in that other case uh, where if you just select the beginning point you can still hold down control and, and do that. So that kind of makes the shortest path um, obsolete in the sense that this is um, this doesn't require you to go to any, into any menus and it works in all cases for you. Anyway, so that was what I, what I wanted to show and um, hopefully that helps you speed up your modeling and your UV unwrapping and any other time that you're making selections to say mark edges or mark seams or bevel weights or whatever you're doing. So anyway, hopefully that helps and uh, have a great day.